Last week, Tim gave a speech on our club goals and our status. The club has an evaluation system where we have to earn up to 10 points on our education goals and membership goals. When Tim checked the Toastmasters International site, we only had two of those 10 points. As club president, I felt a cold, sick feeling in my stomach. I realized how far we had to go to meet those goals. And I didn't even know who was working on what awards. Worse, one of the goals that I set for myself in our club success plan was to develop a reporting and tracking tool so that we knew where we were on those goals. I'm a data geek. How hard could it be? But the sad truth was, I simply did not choose to make the time to develop that tool. Fortunately, I would much rather work with data than watch the Super Bowl. <laughs> so while Tom Brady was making his comeback, so was I! <laughs> Madam Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, my purpose today is not to tell you about all of the steps needed to meet various awards. That's a topic for a different speech. All I will say is that almost every speech you give and almost everything that you do for Toastmasters will count towards some sort of award. Now the hard part for me is keeping track of all these activities. Today I'll show you a solution that will solve our record keeping and tracking problems. The solution is a working prototype that will satisfy our immediate needs for, and providing a base for future development. Last night as I ruminated on the mechanics of presenting from a complex Excel spreadsheet, it occurred to me that I did not check if the chamber has Excel installed on this computer. I made sort of a plan B presentation in PowerPoint, just in case. When I walked in this morning, I was pleased to see they do indeed have Excel 2007, <laughs> which does not support the functionality that I built into the, the Excel spreadsheet. I'm going to ask you to use your imagination today, to imagine there's actually data that we're looking at instead of pictures, and that we actually have functionality there instead of just pictures in a presentation. The tool that I'm working on does four things. It allows us easy data entry of everything that we do for Toastmasters. It gives us a personalized dashboard that shows our progress towards the goals that we're working on. It allows the club officers to see who's working on what goals and how much progress they're making on those goals. And it accumulates all of the details for each project that, is, that are needed to submit your, for your award. Let's do an imaginary demo. Each one of these boxes is supported by a menu. All we have to do is choose from the box. That saves all spelling errors and it saves a lot of typing. The only thing we have to type in is this title or descriptions. If we do a speech, we'll put the title here. If we do some sort of activity, like an event, we'll say, I helped organize the uh, open house. We can assign which manual it comes from and which project. Again, all these are dependent upon each other. So when we select the manual, the projects will only display for that manual. Makes it very easy to pick and you don't have to sort through a lot of data as we're doing this. And again, we can choose which award we're applying it to and which step in that award and the project. And usually there's some sort of evaluator, either for a speech or to sign off that you actually did that activity. When it comes to personal reporting, on our personal dashboard, again, we can select our name from the list that's in the menu box. And all of the data will readjust so that it will present just for that member. And it'll have a little graph there for each chart. Again, green means we're doing well. I actually have real data in there for Marie and a few others. And Marie is very close to getting her competent communication award. We want to get her on the schedule so that we can, she can get that before June 30th. And if I want to look at the details, all of the history is retained in the tool. All those things that we put in the box goes into a simple Excel spreadsheet sort of thing that we can keep forever and ever. 
The good thing about this and the good thing about data is even though this is an Excel spread, uh, spreadsheet right now and a working prototype, no matter what tool we would ever develop or obtain is going to need this data. And in this format, we can import it into any tool. So the work that we put into uh, loading this thing is not wasted. The benefits of this tool is that it's a push to you. Every so often, we can simply send out the whole spreadsheet. You can choose from the list and see how you're doing on your awards. There's really very little data entry for, in, in terms of typing, other than selecting your name and selecting from a menu. And ideally, we can have the VP of membership or VP of education actually doing the data entry on most of this. We can put the whole schedule for every meeting in here and all the roles and it, who did everything. And it won't take much time at all. All it will be is up to you to tell us which award you want it applied to. The work will always need to be done anyway when we're going to submit the award, but we'll always know where we are. It allows us as an officer to know who's working on what and just how far we have to go. Again, most of this is dummy data. A few of us, though, are very close to the awards. Ryan has achieved his ACV, the Advanced Communicator Bronze. We have Neen very close to a couple of awards. Bethany is close to an award. I'm close to an award. We have Stephen and Marie very close to their awards. We can make this by June 30th. We can become and retain the title of President's Distinguished Club. There are just a couple obstacles. First of all, we're going to have to load this data in. I'm going to have to ask you what projects you're working on, what awards you're working on, and you can send me those details. We can put those into the tool, and then we'll have a compi I'll compile the composite. You still need to manage your progress, but now we can alert you and we can encourage you. And for those without Excel, we'll find a way to get the data in and to give you a printed report. So let's recap. The solution will let us track, record, and report all the activities that we do for Toastmasters. All we really need to do is start using it. Toastmasters, you got data? Now we have a place to put it. I'll take any questions that you have, maybe one. Kelly. So for those that, so sometimes we recycle and we go through for people who, for example, completed the competent communication manual once and they're going through it again because I think we can take credit for that if I'm not yes. mistaken. Will this tool allow for that? That's an excellent question, Kelly, and it's not even one of the pe uh, questions I planted in the audience. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a requirement for this sort of tracking tool. I've been in the software development world long enough to know the answer to your question. That's in the next release. <laughs> <laughs> Madam Toastmaster. <laughs>